Bishri Hafi Rahmatullah Ali used to drink by day and he used to drink by night. He used to take alcohol. And he himself says, you know what? One night I had too much to drink. And he was walking and roaming in the streets. When all of a sudden he came across a piece of paper. In that state, he saw a piece of paper and he picked this paper up. It had the name of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala written on it. And he thought to himself, you know what? This paper is dirty. He wiped the piece of paper, he cleaned it, and he put it inside his pocket out of respect for the name of Allah. And he says, you know what? At that time, the only thing I possessed was two dirhams. This was my, you know, earnings. I did not possess anything more than two dirhams. So the thought crossed my mind, let me go to a perfume seller, an ithar seller, and I will buy the best perfume to perfume this piece of paper which had the name of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala written on it. So he went to a perfume seller. He purchased the best perfume that he could buy with two dirhams. And Bishr Hafi, he perfumed this piece of paper. He went home and out of respect for the name of Allah, he put it on a high place. He says, I went to sleep that night. And I saw a dream that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala was saying to me, Oh Bishr, we will elevate your name in the dunya as well as the akhirah, just like you took care of my name in the dunya. You took care of my name in the dunya, I will take care of your name in the dunya as well as the akhirah. I will elevate it just like you elevated my name. I will elevate in the dunya and I will elevate in the akhirah. And indeed Allah elevated his name. He became such. After this, he turned to Allah and he became such that he would walk barefooted. This is why he was called Bishri Hafi. Hafi in Arabic means barefooted. Wherever he would walk, he would walk barefooted. Allah raised his rank so high that wherever he would walk, if there was dirt or filth on the way, before he placed his foot there, the earth would open up and swallow the filth.